Hi! In one of my previous videos, I showed you how I managed to mill steel. It wasn't prettiest cut, nor the most quiet one, but hey, it worked! I would like to thank you all for all the comments. You had a plenty ideas how to make it better. Most common was use conventional milling instead of climb milling, which we will try in this video. I had a few comments to slow down my spindle, but it's not possible as its RPM range from 7.2 to 24k. I will do some cuts with coolant as few of you recommended. Also I will try to increase feed rate to see if increasing feed per tooth will make milling on this machine any better. I have prepared 6 holes, 3 for conventional and 3 for climb milling. As before we will start with 360 mm per minute feed rate and increase to 500 and then to 720. If the end mill survived this test, I've got some more with a different width and depth of cut. Get ready, get set, go! F I forgot to press record button. Anyway, using WD-40 as a coolant makes cheap evacuation extremely difficult. I've ordered coolant mister from China. I will let you know if it's any good as soon as I get it. For now I will continue without coolant. Using magnets to remove metal jibs. Using magnets to remove metal chips did not make this task any lighter. I prefer to clean this with my 2.2 kW pre-EU legislation domestic vacuum cleaner. Yep, carbide doesn't like spongy router. I've got a brown spunky new. That means we can finish our test and we can choose conventional which is uh, this one
360 seems to be uh, the only feed rate which really works on uh, on this configuration. Okay, first conventional. Ah, seemingly spot on. Second. Pretty much the same. Third one which was uh, conventional and last one which was conventional as well in the previous video I used a slightly thinner fiber board than this time which was um, I think unnecessarily thick, which might might have uh, added a little bit to the uh, sponginess of uh, of my machine. So there you go. That's the one for uh, from the last time, and that's the one which I've used this time in thickness. So there you go. You can probably know the answer to the question, conventional or climb milling. On this machine, none. I will have to make some upgrades to stiffen whole construction. It's in the pipeline somewhere. For now I will stick to milling Play-Doh. As always, you like it, you subscribe it. See you next time.